Hi everyone, Mikaze Dragon here, and we're gonna have a two for one video. Boom, we killed it. it took me <clears throat> 11 minutes, but this is the team for Floor 20 Magma Dragon Hard. Doom Tower Hard. So we had who did the most damage? It looks like Valkyrie. Valkyrie did the most damage. Second place with uh, Ultimate Death Knight, and then <coughs> Silva Drake's being in third place. Who healed the most? Apparently Cardell, and I can see that because Cardell can heal when he attacks, and he also gets to team up with his allies to attack. <coughs> kind of shocked that Python didn't heal as much, since that's all he does. But hey. Uh, yeah. Luckily, we know the strategy for Magma Dragon, which is have one person die, revive them before they die again. And that's basically it. After that, it's just a slow kill. The only thing you can't do is make it go on for too long. Uh, which is... Ooh, I, I can't kill this then. Maybe something like this might kill it, but... I highly doubt it. So, what's on the agenda now? We are doing Doom Tower Stage 10. Celestial Griffin. And this is the team I did it <coughs> with. It was a lot easier than I thought it would be. Give me a second. And I do have to say, I totally forgot. I gave Ninja his masteries. I said, screw it, I'm not waiting no more. Here you go, Ninja, here's your masteries. But that being said, uh, this was like a five minute and 32nd team. I don't know. Uh, it, it is not 100%, but I did do it on auto. So, I kind of just said, screw it. Here you go. I hope you work, and it worked. But basically, we have one damage dealer, and everyone else is on healing, defending, reviving, uh, healing over time, shields. Just, I would say on auto, you might have bad RNG and like, or just bad timing of everything. It all depends on what happens on round two, going into round three, I would assume, because I never, like I said, I just said good luck and I kind of just walked away. And then I came back and they, they killed it. So, <clears throat> there are some replacements for some of these units, but not for every every single unit. Like, so the Drakes is just too strong. Reach and set, boom. Uh, Pytheon, if you don't have Pytheon, uh, the Void Fusion, he revives two dead allies, so that's still good enough. <clears throat> Ultimate Death Knight. I'm not sure. Give me a second again. Sorry about that. Um, I'm not sure with Ultimate Death Knight. I'm not sure who can protect as well as he can. I also don't know all the units, so... You might have to look that one up on your own to see if someone can, like, protect your team from dying. Because it does get dicey. And when it gets dicey, you might not kill it. And, you know, the, the fight is a trick in the beginning. It's more when your people start to die and go <clears throat> below 50% health. Once you go below 50% health, and he hits you, 
He hits you again, and you're dead most of the time. That's why I say Ultimate Death Knight might not be replaceable. Uh, Cardell, just a revive on death, or or another reviver. <coughs> Which <coughs> I kind of don't agree with another reviver. You kind of need someone to keep everyone above 50% health. Maybe another cleanser? Um, I'm, I'm not sure, though. I feel like this team... Uh, maybe like an ally attack. Full ally attack team, or maybe three ally attack. Uh, but honestly, it's... In my opinion, is Ninja really doing that work? You just saw him do a big chunk of damage. And if this goes really well, this could be our best run. Yep, look at that. Best run, 120 rounds, only 4 minutes. So Ninja is just popping off. So... That'll be it for today, because that's that's all of Dune Tower we did. Uh, it did take me a while to, you know, find these teams to push through and, you know, get all, through all these stages. But <clears throat> it's like 10 to 30 minutes per stage. And it depends on if they have a healer, reviver, this, that heal over time and there's so much stuff that takes them forever but in the end they get it done they get it done and that's all that matters um yeah i want to try this and then i want to do fire knight because i want to win that fire knight tournament that's only rares and that'll be it so thanks for watching like comment share and subscribe check out the patreon uh <clears throat> Thanks for all the support. You know, leave a comment of maybe other video ideas. I feel like I'm just running in circles, but I'm not too sure. I'm, I'm also not great at this game. This is why I spend a lot of money. Because I suck at this game. I, I just suck. And, and I'm not patient. I'm 100% not patient at all. Other than that, yep. See you guys next time. Dragon Abyss out.